What's going on, YouTube? It's the Independent Stacker coming to you again tonight, December 19th, 2019. I am back, baby, and I'm in full effect. Woo! We're feeling real good, guys. I apologize greatly. It's been a week since my last video, and if you remember that last one, it was a little short. Was a little under the weather. Had some things going on in my life, but baby, we are back. We got this. Woo hoo hoo! Let's check out the big board and see where we're at. Gold is up ten dollars, currently at fourteen eighty eighty one. Silver's up fourteen cents at seventeen thirteen, giving us a ratio of eighty six forty three. Platinum is down five dollars, currently at nine thirty eight seventy eight, and palladium it flirted with two thousand dollars last week, but it is down slightly. Currently at 1950.24. Copper's up slightly, but aluminum is down just a little bit. Rhodium also down, currently at 6,000 even. Barrels of crude oil are up quite a bit, currently at 61.11. We're seeing record pushes in both the Dow Jones and the NASDAQ. Dow closed out today at 28.376.96. And the NASDAQ closed out at 8.887.22. If you guys are following the Bitcoin market, you know we saw quite a dip over the last uh, three or four days. We got as low as, I believe, 6,400 at one point this week. But we're back up. It's down from our last video, but we are back up at 7,180 cents. Tonight's Greg Stacker shout-out is... Townie Stacker. Townie Stacker has been a faithful follower of the Independent Stacker channel now for some time and went back through the records. We had not given him a shout out. He's a newer channel, guys. He's got rookie numbers. I believe he's sitting around somewhere around 24, 25 subscribers. And you guys know we got to boost those numbers. I'm going to post a link down in the description below to his channel. Make sure you slide on over. Check him out. Tell him that the Independent Stacker sent you. In tonight's video, we're going to go ahead and add silver bar. We're adding one silver bar to the stack tonight. This is a 2014 Year of the Horse. These are from Sunshine Mint. Very cool. Very cool. I'm going to go ahead and cut this on out of the plastic. And we're going to add it to the tube. Get that out of there. Nice. Looking real good. All right. Go ahead and add that into the tube. In my absence, I'm sure, guys, you've been a little sad. I know that I've been sad to not be here as much as I'd hoped to be with you guys. And to show a little bit of appreciation for you guys sticking around, I think we'll just go ahead and do ourselves a little giveaway. What do you guys think? So in the last giveaway, Mailman AG had won himself two dimes. I guess we'll just go ahead and show these real quick. These are 1964s. They're looking real good. Real nice. And I think we'll just go ahead and add a little something to the giveaway. Two more grams of the Val Camby bar. So guys, four tonight's giveaway to get entered into the giveaway something that we have not talked about or i have not seen a whole lot about in our community here in the last 24 hours is there hasn't been really a whole lot of people talking about the impeachment vote last night of donald j trump it's something i think as stacking community members and precious metal collectors in this community i think it is something that does need to be talked about. 
Uh, you know, we hit record highs, or near record highs, at the Dow Jones and the NASDAQ today. They didn't seem to really care. Um, and the markets didn't react negatively, I would say. I think we've held pretty steady the last couple days, especially in this last day. We haven't seen anything really break out uh, and plummet um, or really go up in, in value either. So do you think that the markets understand that the impeachments, you know, the impeachment isn't going any further than the House. Uh, I know Democrats are really, they're really touting this and they had, they had uh, good old Nancy Pelosi uh, drunk up on stage yesterday and uh, touting how, uh, how big of a victory this was for the Democratic Party. But is it really? Now it's going on to the Senate, maybe. We don't know. Nancy Pelosi is saying that uh, she's going to hold the impeachment uh, recommendation back from the Senate until they can get their act together, quote-unquote. And really, I think that is just meaning she wants to hold on to it until we get closer to some primaries um, so they can keep it noteworthy. I really I think they're, the Democrats are just shooting themselves in the foot. But I want to know what you guys think. What do you guys think about the impeachment proceedings, how that all went down yesterday with the U.S. House of Representatives? You're going to want to post a link or post a comment down below in the comment section on what you guys think. When you guys post a comment, that will enter you in to the drawing for the dimes and the grams of the Valcambi bar. One comment per household um you have until sunday night that'll be sunday uh december let's see it'll be 20 21 22 uh sunday december 22nd uh let's say 7 p.m you have until sunday at 7 p.m to post your comment down below on how you think what how what do you feel about the impeachment the impeachment proceedings uh, are you for the impeachment? Are you against it? Let's get some discussion going, guys. Let's go ahead. Let's talk about it. Let's get it out in the open. Guys, I really do greatly appreciate every single one of you, regardless of how you comment down below. But if you happen to like tonight's video, go ahead and hit that like button right over here in the corner. And if you happen to be new to the Independent Stacker channel, go ahead and consider smashing that subscribe and jingle jangle bell right here in the corner, bing bong, so you can be notified of when new content is coming out. The Independent Stackers here once again remind you, if the women don't find you handsome, they should at least find your pockets heavy.